We don't know if playoff Jimmy is a thing or not, but the 2023 NBA playoffs proved once again that Jimmy Butler is a trash-talking god. Here are six times Jimmy Buckets flat-out destroyed his opponents. Number 1. The Smirk Jimmy Butler is a refined trash talker. He has total mastery over the subtle art of shitting on people. That's why he didn't even need to speak where a smirk would do it. No one knows what got to Grant Williams. Chances are the Celtics power forward thought he had the game sealed after hitting a three-pointer in the fourth quarter of Game 2 of the Eastern Conference Finals. Now the bucket made it a nine-point game with six minutes left on the clock, and that could have been the dagger. But Williams then had the bright idea to trash talk Butler on his way back. Butler first gave Williams the most, oh no, you don't want to do that with me, my G look, and then in each possession of the game, attacked and scored on him to the point where Joe Mazzulla had to take Williams out of the game. But that wasn't the end of his ordeal, as Butler made sure Williams paid for his mistake in the following games. Number 2. The Timeout Revenge is a dish best served cold, and Butler knows a thing or two about the restoration industry. We're talking about a guy who managed to sell a cup of coffee to his fellow NBA players for 20 bucks during the bubble, mind you. While his coffees were to provide a cozy atmosphere, what he served to Al Horford in the same series he destroyed Grant Williams was not at all that relaxing. Big Al thought they were flying high in the opening game of the series, and once again, what felt like a dagger three went back to haunt the green. After hitting a corner three, Horford saw Eric Spolstra call a timeout, a gesture he repeated in an exaggerated fashion. Then Butler, well, he didn't like that. In the third game of the series, leading 2-0 already, the Heat hit a three of their own, which took the deficit to 23 points. And then you know what happened. Al Horford got his own medicine served to it. Number 3. Tobias Over Me? Here's a quick one down memory lane. The Philadelphia 76ers were between a rock and a hard place when they had to choose between Jimmy Butler and Tobias Harris in what would end up being a terrible mistake. They kept the latter at the expense of the former. Then Jimmy did what Jimmy does, eliminated them the very next season from the playoffs. And he made sure that not only the 76ers, but the entire world knew that he didn't forget shouting, Tobias Harris over me? Number 4. I'm Him Jimmy Butler is low-key the most competitive player to ever play the game, after MJ and the late great Kobe Bryant. And when his teammates fail to match his intensity, things can get pretty intense. That's exactly what happened back when Butler was with the Timberwolves. Sick of Carl Anthony Towns' attitude, Butler showed up to training one day, and for a scrimmage, he opted to play with the third team against the starters. He not only won the game 18-6, but yelled things that probably still live rent-free in every single man's mind who were against him. Things like, y'all think that team can win without me? I'm him. Pay me. Number 5. I Own You With just a little effort, anyone can do some sort of trash talk, but very few men can do it while on the road and trailing, and only Jimmy Butler can do it against a defensive hotshot like Drew Holiday. Butler was at his best against Milwaukee in the opening round of the 2023 playoffs, and he made sure that his dominance over his primary defender had nothing to do with the score of the game. That's why, with a devilish look in his eyes, Butler told Holiday that chilling phrase, I own you. Number 6. This My Shit The way the postseason started was like the biggest warning sign we could ever get about Jimmy Butler in the heat, and how he is one of the best to ever trash talk. Him yelling, This My Shit, as he tormented the Bucks, even before the series was over by that point, was telling. And Mr. Buckets? We'd like to take the opportunity to say it once again. It really is your thing. Let's just say thing. If you like this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and make sure you hit that notification bell for more hoop goodness coming your way.